Alex Browning is a teen with the ability to see the future. On a school trip, he and 40 of his classmates will fly to Paris. Alex has a rumor that the plane will explode, killing everyone before it takes off. He awakens and warns everyone that the plane will explode. He is taken off the plane and onto the airport by the security guards. Valerie Luton, a teacher, and students Billy Hitchcock, Claire Rivers, Terry Cheney, Carter Horton, and Todd Wagner get off during the commotion. Soon after, the plane explodes. The survivors are shocked to find Alex's premonition has come true. Did you, uh, really think we're gonna take fucking more Greenland? You know, because of you, I gotta sit here and watch Stuart Little. Thank you. What? Attention! Notre voyage commence! Days later, Todd slips in his bathroom and falls on a clothesline in his shower. His speed causes the rope to wrap around his neck and strangle him to death. Everyone considers it a suicide after his body is discovered. Since they survived the plane crash, Alex believes that death is after them. He discovers that they are supposed to die in the same way as they died on board the plane. Claire is called by him, and they go to a cafe to discuss Alex's theory. The mortician said that death has to sign, right? Now what if you, me, Todd, Carter, Terry, Billy, Mrs. Luton messed up that design that we cheated in? What if it still is our time, and we will die now, not later, unless we find the patterns and cheat it again? Pictures in my whole destination Cut myself, keep running <laughs> We have a bit of a reunion here. When are you, uh, moving? Uh, a couple weeks. That's too Carter bad. Dick. She wasn't her favorite teacher. Look, guys, there's something I need to tell you. Now she's gotta move. Hey, oh, you guys are all in the Enough! They died! Get over it. I will not let this the most important thing in my life! I'm moving on. Carter, if you want to waste your life out of Alex every time you see him, then you can just drop fucking dead. Miss Luton is next on the list. She has a string of household injuries that result in her computer blowing up in her face, and a knife piercing her and her house exploding.
the four remaining passengers take off in a car only to have it stall on the railroad tracks. They all get out except Carter, who notices an approaching train. The others encourage him to leave. Carter decides to leave, and with Alex's help, he escapes. Billy is decapitated by a piece of thin metal from the car wreckage. Alex finds out that death will place the person who is the next in line to die if someone intervenes and prevents them from dying. Who's next to see it? It's me, right? That's why you're not saying. All right, then why bother? So why wait any longer? Slow down, Carter! What are you doing? Carter, put your hand back on the wheel! Billy, open the fucking door! Open the door! Carter, listen to me! Hey, get out of the car! It ain't my time. I can't get out! Alex! That's right! You're next, Carter! Fuck you, Billy, I'm not dead! Oh, you will be! And you ain't taking me with you! Tried to capitalize, but I caught you. You fuck. I could beat you. Yeah, maybe not forever. But I got this cabin rigged to beat you now. Clear Rivers, his girlfriend, is next in line. She is at home when lightning strikes a tree, triggering a chain of events that eventually result in her being in her car with a power line on top of it. Alex swoops in and saves her, cheating death once more. The three remaining passengers fly to Paris six months later, believing they finally cheated death for good. Alex sees omens around him and suspects that death is still after them at a cafe. Alex is about to be hit by a bus as he walks away, unaware of it. Claire has a vision and shouts to Alex, who he saves. However, the bus passes a traffic pole, sending it flying in the air, eventually hitting an electrical sign on top of the cafe, which reads Café La Mero 81. The sign comes to a halt, just as Alex is about to be struck. Carter comes and saves him. Carter asks Alex, who's next, after claiming that death has been overthrown. The sign comes back down, this time backward, indicating 18 and hitting Carter. We made it. Paris. Just can't believe we got on a plane again. Wow, we finally completed a puzzle. So there's something missing. To all of our friends, I can't be here. There's just something, you know, something I can't figure out. Alex, just let it go. I the explosion determined the order of our deaths, right? But when I intervened and saved Carter, it skipped him and went to the next person on the path that went to Billy. And then it was clear that I intervened and saved her, so it went to me. But in my case, no one intervened. Why did it skip you? Maybe that was the design all along. Or you could still be next. <laughs> Where 
you guys back at the hotel, okay? See, it's true. I told you you were next, man. Next. Then it just skipped me. So who's next? <laughs>